Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dad Deck, and for our daily climb today, we are the defect. We've got specialised vintage in Midas. Not terrible, but them high scores look fairly low. And relics are normally decent to work with. It depends what the single card, uh, the five copies of the single card is, rebound. Zero cost cards obviously work well, like claws. Um, what else do we want? We need elites, because that's the only way we get cards. And shops, obviously, and shops. Um, right. Should we hit an early shop? That seems like something that not everybody would do. Because I hate doing it myself. Let's go for this shop and see if we can buy anything that's um, of decent quality. Well, we're going to reband a reband and a defend. It's going to be fun. We're going to keep rebanding everything. Reband, defend. I'm actually just going to defend again. If I'd have done that differently, could I have killed you? I think I could have done. But never mind. Reband, 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 reband. It's going to be fun, right? It's going to be fun. Claw is what you want. But then you want draw as well. Sweeping beam? Or remove a strike? Sweeping beam. We need draw with the rebounds. Because we can reband, claw, draw. Reband, claw, draw. Um, dual cast to see who it hits. And, well, rebound, dead. Awesome. Blood vial, very nice to start with. You're going to be a pig, aren't you? Rebound claw, definitely. We are going to defend, strike, strike. And you're going to ruin my runic dodecahedron straight away. Thanks for that one. I should rebound, rebound claw. Oh my god, shuriken. I'm in love with the run already. Yep. I kind of wanted it to hit claw, but never mind. Do we go turn one? I think you do, actually. Rebound, zap, dual cast. It's not the most damage ever, but it is quite a bit of damage. Um, I'm going to go zap, defend, defend, actually. Because we need to try and not take quite as much damage. Rebound, claw. Rebound, good strike. I could have rebound a rebound. This is what we want. Rebound, claw. Rebound, sweeping beam. Into the claw. And then next turn we get claw back again if the lightning didn't kill him. Meat on the bone is going to be very nice. Um, overclock as well goes quite well. Rip and tear would have been very nice. But, oh yeah, we can't heal. Forgot about that one. Well, at least we've only got one more elite to go. Wait, not we can't heal, we can't rest, sorry. Um, let's go with an overclock first. Regret it instantly. Rebound, rebound, zap. I did want one of them to kill him, in case you were wondering. Didn't really want it to go like this then. Nine, eighteen, we've actually killed you. Oh, oh. Can we get back to full health please, that would be awesome. Give me the overclock to start with. I don't mind the draw. And being as though we can't upgrade dual cast or um, zap, then fair enough. We need to do that. We're back to full health, so we've got more energy. We need even more draw. You should actually be quite easy. You know, I'm actually going to reband overclock. Reband. Z don't reband the zap, you madman. We don't want skills back. We want attacks. Mm. Rebound overclock. I hate doing this. Because even if I throw the defense out now, it wouldn't be enough. Let's just leave him. Let him hit me. This is the turn we want. Rebound, claw. Sweeping beam. Well, actually, we could have just done anything there. Dual cast would have killed him. Regal pillow as well. Alrighty then. Um, yes, I'll take an FTL. It's draw and an attack. Hmm. It... Happened first turn for once, yeah. Do I want dart for gold? Not really, I've got Midas. Gold should be okay. You guys could be a pig. Although. Let me see where the dual cast goes first. No direction that I actually wanted it to go in. Hilarious. Rebound, claw. Overclock. Ooh, rebound, claw. 
We are going to take damage, but there's not really much I can do about that. I needed a couple more attacks. Even this one wouldn't kill him, so what's the point? Focus is no good because we've already used our orb. Never mind. Um, I know I need to kill this dude, but rebound the claw again. Bear in mind, we have only got one claw that's doing all this damage. So, it's not terrible. And yes, we're back at full health. The wasted rests are so upsetting. Let's go overclock first. Rebound, rebound, sweeping beam. Rebound, strike. Oh, I can't get another attack. That is dead upsetting. This is why we need more draw. Um, am I just willing to attack you because you're going to hurt me this turn either way? Let's go rebound, sweeping beam. FTL, sweeping beam. Rebound. Screw it, we'll just not defend at all, apparently. I will regret keep doing that, by the way. I am just going to play rebound and nothing else there. I think we can win this in... Well, win this race with this dude. Rebound, claw. Strike, yeah. That's going to be a fairly painful attack from you, but you are basically split already. Rebound, claw. Sweeping beam. Claw. Strike. Yeah, that one claw is getting so much shirt use. It is unreal. Admittedly, this is getting a little bit tight now. I'm actually going to rebound that defend. You're doing 16 damage. We can block it all. Now we can't. No way. I need to use this to live. Oh, thank God. I thought I died on the first boss again then. <laughs> I mean, all of these aren't great, and apologies for breathing, blowing straight into the mic. Electrodynamics is the only one that I'd take just with no prior build. Rainbow doesn't really do it for me. Thunderstrike doesn't really do it for me. Let's go Electro. Definitely don't want Claw. I actually think... Uh, claw? What am I even on about? Velvet Choker. Sorry, you definitely don't want Velvet Choker. Philosopher's Stone has something about it, but I'd actually like to remove two basic strikes. Because they are getting in the way. We just want the Claw whipping around. 18 card deck is quite a nice thin deck to work with. We can get three elites and this shop here. Rest between them and elites. Fair enough, yeah. I'm fine with that. Let's go. You guys are going to suck, aren't you? Well, rebound sweeping beam. Overclock. Come on, think about it, game. Um, rebound sweeping beam. And then we've just got you that's attacking. I know, I know. We didn't really want to take five damage, but I did down two of them. <clears throat> And we'll heal that back. Slowly, anyway. Um, rebound. Sweeping beam. FTL. Rebound. Sweeping beam. I've never used sweeping beam so many times. Wow. I actually quite like it. Are you ready? Sounds like Jigsaw. I want to play a game. A heal. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Five health. Yay. Thanks for that one. <sighs> anyway. I am going to rebound overclock. Electrodynamics, hilarious. Um, I do actually think we go with that. Just to give me a line. Nine lightning per turn. Alrighty then. Rebound. Claw. Rebound. Sweeping beam. Play the claw. Don't play the overclock. She wants sweeping beam for next time. Wait. No, we didn't. Anyway, let's see if we can just kill him. Oh my god, it's claw. Can I get a rebound, please? My god. This is working awesomely. Toxic egg. Hello there. You could screw things up, though. Right? I'd rather you didn't, but you could screw things up for me. Rebound. Thank you. 
you know what? Because these aren't that useful, I'm going to pop both of them now, just to get through the Sneko quicker, because you can screw my claw up something fierce. And there we go, then. I can't even rebound the goddamn claw. Oh, in that case, rebound, sweeping beam. An electro for one? Don't mind if I do. I mean, the 15 damage sucks, but everything else about that turn worked out kind of okay. You are dead, sir. You took more of my health than I would have... Oh my god, we don't even need upgrades anymore. Give me the sharp now. No claw. Upsetting. Bag of marbles. Yes. Oddly smooth stone. Yes. Streamline. Yes. Um, I'm actually going to take impatience as well. I know I'm going a bit crazy now. The metamorphosis is for the free cards. I don't need any of these, although machine learning works quite well. So we're probably assorted for cards and that, and we've still only got a 22 card deck, just um, FYI. Um, I'd love to block here, but I need lightning to hit you. Thank God. We're still taking 18, so I didn't get completely out of that one, but um, FTL. Yes. Streamline. Yes. Electro definitely needs to be played. Because he's going to summon more minions. And they're all going to die. Okay. Mm Dual cast. Very strong. You need a slight tap. Reband. The reband. And the claw. We can get the machine learning out there as well. I'm hoping you're going to try and summon some more minions again. It would be very nice. Um... Reband this reband, then this claw wants rebanding, then we'll just play this for damage because I don't want to draw. I'm not sure if it would have drawn the claw or the reband first. I'm not completely 100% sure. Reband claw, FTL into claw, and you're dead. Yeah, this setup works very nicely. Pen nip, that should work well. Don't want to add too much to this. I think we'll be fine without them. Don't get me wrong, the melter is very nice. Is it nice enough to take? I think we're just going to work with the rebounds. Ball lightning is also quite nice. I might have made a mistake by not taking anything there, but... We need electro. Like, right now. Uh, okay. Um, let's rebound, a rebound, and a claw. Get the charge battery out there, ready for next turn. Need Electro. Thank you, Electro. Um, ba -bam, ba -bam, ba -bam, ba. Electro and the door cast, and then we see if we need to hit you. We do not. I mean, I'm going to take damage. There's no way around that. Rebound Claw again. Obviously. So, you're more than likely dead next turn. Oh, and we're just under half health. That is wonderful news. Um, <clears throat> actually, rebound, streamline claws. Got you? Good. Meat on the bone works. Guria. Oh, my word. Can I get some rest stops, please? Mm, not quite as big a fan of this as you would expect. You guys are doing 20 damage. You know what? I'm going to do that, that, and that. Bullseye, all for one, rebound, another rebound. Are you taking the biscuit game? We don't want more rebounds. We've already got too many of them. Oh my god, the free reboundable, reboundable, all for one, is just insanity. Um, anyway, let's go with... Need to work my energy out here. <clears throat> We've got pen, neb, dooby, dooby, doo doo. Um, so, that's one energy there. That's three. Electro? Do we need Electro? It does help. But instead of Streamline... You know what? Let's do it anyway. Smack you like that. Should have Streamlined did, did, did you. But anyway, we're going to keep going. I 
I could say there's not really much else I can do here. Impatience does nothing. We are taking 8 damage. That does mean we're in healing range. Rebound the rebound, obviously. And when I say healing range, I mean meat on the bone range. Pear, also very nice. Gives me a little bit of a heal. Smiling mask, fair enough. We're still going for the elites. Nothing has changed. Not yet, anyway. Uh, let's go with an overclock. Ugh. Rebound the zap, I guess, and we can dual cast it. Don't want to impatience in case I draw something that I do actually want. You're going to sting. I can tell you that straight away. See, even if I play Electro, it's not going to kill you, which is a slight problem. The only other way is, and I hate it, Streamline charge battery, and then we don't realistically need the electrodynamics, but we have now got frailty, which sucks. Four block. Okay. Mm rebound, a rebound, a rebound, a claw. I think. Owie, my face. Um, rebound, claw, FTL. Rebound, claw. Yes, I will stop just walking through the process of what the hell I'm doing. I say that, I probably won't. I'd love to get the health up enough so that we don't have to worry about resting. Let's go with this first in case we draw a streamline. We did not, but we have got sweeping beam and I'm actually going to pop this. I'd love to play rebound first, but with the pen nib I'd rather do that. <clears throat> rebound. Don't really want to rebound impatience, but let's do that instead. We don't really want to draw now, so um, yeah, let's leave that one. The vulnerability first turn was very nice. Electrodynamics. Ho, ho, ho. I have a machine gun. Anyway, we're not doing that first because we're going to go rebound, claw, FTL. Rebound, claw, well... By then. Dreamcatcher, fair enough. Being as though we can rest, that is quite useful. Yes, we will take a skim. I said I want more draw, so I will take more draw when it appears. You pain in the backside. Rebound, FTL. Rebound, sweeping beam. Why not FTL? Can we get something better than a defend? No, we cannot. Yeah, just play the block. We'll save them for the boss, possibly. Good. Rebound Streamline is fairly amazing. We'd love to make Runic Dodecahedron more accessible, but with the way I'm playing, it's not going to work like that because we're not really adding any defense. In fact, we're not really adding any cards. Um, I am going to lift. We want these claws to be stronger. Well, we want everything to be stronger. Mr. Stabby Face, we don't want you to be stronger. Let's go with an overclock first. Uh, horrible. I mean, the energy that we've started off with isn't horrible. But we're not going to get that every time. Hilarious. Rebound zap, I guess. Machine learning. Do we want to? I mean, we're all taking 18 damage at the moment anyway. Let's defend. We might get streamlined, and then that's going to be loads better with, um, hello there, with pen nib. And a charge battery. If we take one damage, we are in meat on the bone range. So I'd like to kill him next turn, if at all possible. 47 damage seems a bit implausible, though. We're going to rebound Claw, Impatience, and FTL, Claw. In fact, we're going to do it. Oh my god. I thought it was unreasonable. It really wasn't. Sundial. We've got a thin enough doubt that that could possibly work. Give me a boot sequence for that early um, early block. I know I realistically I should have rested there, but we're going to pop both of these straight away. I'd love to get a rebound so we can get this claw going. Unfortunately, no dice, so claw. We'll see you next lap. That does suck quite a bit. <clears throat> Mm, do I want to pen nib this? Not particularly. I draw the block for 10. 
We need to keep the health up so we can survive his execute. Now, I think this is more of a turn where we go charge battery and sweeping beam to see what we get. Never mind. Metamorphosis, Sunder, Ball Lightning, Rip and Tear, Streamline, Thunder Strike. Ooh. Right. We're already under execute range. We need to murder this dude. I mean, like, lightning fast. Well, that's going to be useful, isn't it? Beautiful. At least the streamlines are nice and free now. Where are we in Pemnib? Eight. We're nearly there. Rebound the claw. Although that is 16 damage times two. But I need to bring the claw back. I should have thought about this before I went. Rebound the claw still, because then we can electro and make this do the actual damage that Pemnib was going to do. Although rebinding that would have been dead nice, because it's free actually. We need to go like full ham on this dude, because he's going to flatten me otherwise. I do still think he's going to flatten me. 152 damage, plus 10 plated armor. We've got to get all defense this turn to survive. Actually, you're only doing 32 damage. Why aren't you as powerful as I expected you to be? Honestly, thought he was going to like just crush me. Now I'm like, what attacks can I get out there? Rebound Sunder, definitely. Just play these. I don't really need machine learning at the minute. 12 damage from your main attack. Oh, now. Rebound Sunder. Overclock. Rebound Sunder. Sweeping Beam. <laughs> oh, it's working. It's working just how we want it to. Meteor Strike? Because then if we got even more draw, Meteor Strike would make this endless. Because we can just keep rebounding things and then drawing. And I know it's going to be awkward getting the energy. In fact, yeah, it's going to be quite bad getting the energy because we didn't get an energy relic last time. We've not even got Lantern. That might be a silly choice. Let's take a machine learning then. <laughs> I still think we could take nuclear battery. For when we get, like, loads of rebounds. We don't really play orbs too much. Yes, we do a little bit, but not loads. And we have got extra energy to start with now. We could have taken Meteor Strike, goddammit. But the thing is, once we took damage, it wouldn't have been viable anymore. So, um, that's my counter-argument. I would like to hit this rest just so I can fill up my Guria. And then hopefully, the rest is um, history. Hmm. Rebound, rebound, rebound. Kills you off at least. Then we can zap and dual cast. I'm actually glad that it hit you twice. Come on, we need them claws. Electro is very nice. Rebound sweeping beam. I am taking damage already. Wonderful. Just what I always wanted. Oh yeah, we pushed the energy through. We're still taking damage, which does actually suck. I was being sarcastic before, but... I actually thought we'd manage it. Never mind. Need to take you down. That pen nib. We just need freer blocks. That's the only problem at the minute. Because this three energy really isn't working too well, is it? Claw. At least kills you. Skim. Please. Rebound Claw, FTL. I know the FTL wouldn't have worked. Bag of Prep is quite nice. We are going to this shop because we've got nearly a thousand gold. Um, so, definitely, Rebound, FTL. Let's go Skim. Rebound, FTL. We need the boot sequence. You guys are doing 16 damage. I can door cast. And actually, if Dorcast hits you once, then we win. Alrighty then, game. If that's how it's going to be, I'll take two damage. It's fine. It doesn't upset me greatly at all. 46 damage. Cool. Goodbye and goodbye. 
gremlin horns actually very nice do 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 I mean, we could get rid of a few of the rebounds, right? There are a few too many. But now that's what the thing's about. I could get rid of Zap and Dualcast, but I'm not gonna. Let me get rid of a Strikes. Even the upgraded one's only as good as a base rebound. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna take Dolly's Mirror just so I can duplicate the Claw, I think. Because we do need one more of those, at least. I do like the Blind for Dono and Decker and Strawberry and Juzu Bracelet. And Steam Barrier is actually very nice. Rip and tear, sweeping beam. You know what? I'm willing to take a glacier. And why the hell not? So yeah, just spent a grand there. Don't think we want to hit this shop, which was a secondary plan, but never mind. So we're only up to 31 cards, even with that buy-in spree. Hopefully it's going to work out still. Um, in that case... Rebound, rebound. We might as well play the charge battery to bring that back. Self-repair and machine learning are also quite good. You're not doing any damage, so let's move to the next turn. 40. Rebound, the good claw. Because this one got upgraded from toxic... Uh, what is it? The burning egg, amusingly. And one of those. And... I mean, we're not taking damage anyway. Get the glacier out there. No, don't do it. Let's do it this way. We got a claw, beam, cell, blizzard, rip and tear, and a doom and gloom. And they're all reboundable because they're all free. Oh, baby. I am going to rebound beam cell. Sweeping beam. Rebound beam cell. Sweeping beam. <laughs> beam cell. And now we've got... A fun way of keeping vulnerability up on you. Isn't it awesome? I mean, I could bring back the claw, but I'm going to bring back the streamline. There is no way this dude is doing damage anyway. And now we've got a pen nib for our streamline. Admittedly, that does like slightly more. Let's try and build that streamline back up. Uh, streamline? That pen nib, sorry. Ready for next fight. Fossilized Helix. Hello. Um, we still want to finish Guria off. There we go. That's all three stacks of that one done. Beautiful. The Giant Head. That should bode well for us. We draw a lot. Right. Start with Machine Learning. Definitely. Um, boot Sequence. I'm going to overclock to start with. Because then we can rebound Streamline. Impatience. You know what? Get the other machine learning out there. Then another streamline. So we're racking the strength up. And the time dilated damage is getting quite hefty against him. So. Rebound claw. In fact we should blind to start with. Sweeping beam. That's a pen nib. Let's go. Rebound claw. Can't do anything else, but that's fine. We've still got this buffer intact, and that's what I'm trying to keep. Please give me a rebound. Yes. Rebound. Claw. Sweeping beam. Glacier, actually, because we do need some defense. And claw and claw. <clears throat> I'm glad we've not got the uh, time eater for the uh, final boss. That would have been slightly annoying. Only slightly annoying, like, but... Let's go with one of these. And a sweeping beam. Rebound FTL. Doesn't work how we want it to, but that's fine. Let's get the self-repair out there. I am actually going to play the zap, because then I can play the electrodynamics. And then next turn, you are dead. Regardless of us doing anything. I mean, I'm going to do something, just because I can. And it gets a pen nib up. Ginger. Lovely. Um, <clears throat> we could take Aggregate, we could take Turbo. Compile Driver, I think, is the weakest link there. But Aggregate wouldn't work too well unless we got it first turn. I'm going to skip. I think we've got enough energy. Can we have some good question marks, please? Are we likely to hit another shop? If we're dodging this one, no. Take my gold. What did we get? Intense burner. Wonderful. 
ornamental fan. Wonderful. And we're going to go this way. I mean, we can't do anything else like, but we can get another card. And another beam, well, a beam cell seems quite useful, actually, with all the rebounds. Are you, are you comfy under there, Luna? I can feel her clawing around. Um, so, you're already vulnerable. Good start. Rebound, beam cell. Overclock. Let's rebound the beam cell again. Machine learning. I should have rebound the uh, charge battery, but never mind. We're going to play the charge battery either way. We have got buffer. I do hope you do a big attack, actually. Good. Um, rebound claw. I'm actually not going to play FTL in the right order this time. Because I don't want to draw the claw. Not why it's only doing one damage. He has got six turns of vulnerability. Though. That is quite crazy. Um... Yes, the blind. I'm actually not going to rebound this claw. I'm going to rebound this streamline. How far are we from Pennib? We've just this second used it. Alrighty then. Although. Oh, I can't kill you. I can avoid taking damage. Can I hit you three times next turn? Because these are going to do one damage each. Oh yeah, we've got the boot. Awesome. Another rebound, you say? Amusingly, how could I say no? But I am going to say no, because 32 cards is about where I want to be. Would actually love to take you down first, if at all possible. But it does look like it's not going to be at all possible. So we're going to do it like that. Um, let's see if we get any more rebounds before I go mad. Or a sweeping beam, actually. Dorcas, where are you going? Because if one hits this dude, then we can use this one on you. We have got the pen nib. Love it. Love it. Let's get Metamorphosis going. Sunder, go for the ice scrape. Sweeping beam in a blizzard. Good. Good. Hopefully we'll get some of those right this second. And lucky me. Bye. Bottled Tornado, you say? Well, for Dono and Decker, I'd actually like an Electrodynamics to be innate. Just so we can make sure that we've got the constant damage going. Well, love that. Let's go Electro. I'm actually going to push all the orbs straight through. Let's see if we can get anything else. Not particularly. You are all going to defend by the middle, dude. In that case, you can take Slap. Need more Lightning. Please. The free sweeping beam is awesome. Um, well, rebound this sweeping beam. Oh, hello, Core Surge. You need to die. Um, didn't really need to do all that, but anyway. Oh, Pennib. I could have just beam cell. Uh, sweeping beamed there and killed them all, but never mind. I actually prefer the vulnerability to the weakness for Dono and Decker. And a final sharp. How dare you say that to me as soon as I enter? Couple more claws are nice. I will take the deep breath, actually, because we've got the shuffling thing, haven't we, every time you shuffle. Could work out well for me. You know what? Give me another sweeping beam now. Alright, let's go. Come at me, you two. It actually feels like it's been quite a while, but I don't think it has. We've not got that many powers. I'm going to take capacitor. Look at that energy to start with. Oh my days. Um, I do want Electro at the front. Into the Glacier. We have got Buffer that I really would like to not use if at all possible. Um, you're doing 20. We're fine. Don't really want to dual cast though, do we? Self-repair. Let's... Rebound defend. I know, right? Don't really want to do it like that, but what choice have I got? Right, 26 damage. Fair enough. Let's rebound a sweeping beam. FTL. FTL. If I play the sweeping beam, I can't play the defend, and I need to play the defend to only use the buffer and not lose the perfect. So, I think we do that and metamorphosis, because I need this uh, ASAP. Got some nice AoE attacks there. Bye bye, buffer. But we knew that was coming, because we haven't got much in the way of defence anyway. 
No rebounds. It's upsetting. I am going to zap because it pushes the energy through. Rip and tear. Where are you going? Fair enough. I mean, I guess you play everything. Let's make you vulnerable for three turns, being as though this is going to hit both of you. And now we've got a pen nib. I need to remember that and use an AoE. Oh, we took one damage. I hate everything. The perfect is... Oh, and now we're intangible. Ha. Hilarious game. Rebound the streamline. Let's blind them all. Hologram me back, actually. The upgraded claw again. So that does kill you. Free cold snap. Streamline. Why not? Deep breath. Have you got anything decent for me? Blind. I actually don't mind that. Let's keep him weak for a little while. Got to remember, the front page scores were about 1,100, so it's not terrible. Um, really probably shouldn't have done this, but never mind. Rebound claw. Hilarious. And that was a pen nibbed claw. I've got no fear of you killing me whatsoever. Um, rebound claw. I've got to kill him with a claw. Got to. That was an awesome run. I loved it. <laughs> Tis win number four. All you need is rebounds and claws. And then a tiny bit of draw. 1029. It was 1100 for front page. Come on. Surely. It's not going to be front page. I know. But. Ooh. I actually expected it to be a little higher than that. Not that I'm upset. Don't get that confused. That is a very good score. 314. There are 14 hours and 18 minutes left to go. So, um, yeah, that should drop. I don't think we'll be in the top 500 by the end of the day. But either way, I'm quite impressed with that. And yesterday, another claw run. I can tell from the name alone. Quick claw. Um, but we finished in 178th with 12 hours left to go. Let's see where we actually finished. We tied with a lot of people yesterday, didn't we? 11.55s, 11.55s, 11.55s. We finished in 265th place. Not bad, really. We lost just under 100 places, but, you know, with 12 hours left, I think just under 100 places is actually very good. So, um, yeah, we've had uh, a few nice dailies in a row now. What have we got? Um, Tuesdays we were 136th, Wednesday 178th, today 314th. Yeah, yeah. I'm quite impressed with all of them at the minute. They're um, runs that are boding to my strengths, which is always good. Either way, that is it for this episode. So thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. And don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. Other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers!